Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you if you're having an issue with the Final Cut Pro crashing on you. There is a fix for it, so I'm going to be showing you exactly what is happening on my computer. It's a MacBook Pro 2019 version and uh, I was working on my project and all of a sudden the app crashed. And I couldn't figure out exactly what is happening. Uh, every time I start it, you know, it just crashed. So let's go ahead and start Final Cut Pro. And over here, you're going to see it's launching and then my project starts to load up and then it crashes. And I get this uh, error on top and uh, it says Final Cut Pro quit unexpectedly and then gives you certain option, you know. So I have done everything by reporting and everything. But every time I start and see it's going to crash one more time. And I couldn't get beyond this. You know, I restarted my computer, did everything I could, but for some reason, it just keeps doing it. So let's take a look exactly what I did to fix it. So what you need to do is launch your Final Cut Pro, and on the left-hand side of the screen, you see all these different projects. You know, and you have to be very quick. Pick something different, you know, and then start clicking on it really fast. So basically, now you're forcing your application to launch that application. And uh, here you can see that it did not crash on me this time. And uh, Let's go ahead and launch it one more time and you can see now it's going to start launching a different project. So before it was launching a completely different one which kept crashing on me and now since I forced myself to start a different application or a different project, now it's uh, not crashing. So now I have to figure out exactly which project was that one that was, that was causing the crash so I can show you guys that this method does work and you know it's just the corrupt project that's causing your uh, Final Cut Pro to crash so um, you know I think BMW is the one see now I launched it and then it crashed on me right away and now when I start the application one more time that's gonna be my default and without me doing anything it's just gonna probably gonna crash until you know I start pressing something different and you can see now I launched the HVAC one and it did not crash on me but as soon as I launched the BMW application it just crashes on me so I'm gonna go ahead and delete that and this is what you need to do is just remove that project from there you may have a lot of work that you have put in there but this is the best way to do it you know get rid of the one that is faulty so you don't it does not crash on you and just uh, be very quick when you're selecting your projects when it's launching now many things can depend on the speed of the computer how fast your computer boot up you know how fast it or however long it takes for it to load your projects uh, you know in my case I have like you know, one of the top of the line uh, MacBooks that I purchased you know so it's very fast uh, but you know for those if you have a slower one it might be in your benefit because it may take a little bit longer for it to start launching that particular project so you may have enough time to select a different project and just keep double clicking on it in a fast pace uh, so again, you know, you just have to be very quick, you know, and uh, as soon as the, pro the uh, Final Cut Pro is loading on the computer, just keep your cursor in this area and just pick a different project that you have worked in the past and you know it works good and just keep tapping it, you know, you may use an external mouse, you know, if you think that's going to be a little bit easier. So just keep tapping it, just keep tapping it with a faster rate and, you know, eventually you will be able to launch a different program or a different project that you have worked in the past so hopefully it helps you guys if you like the video please subscribe to my channel and like the video thank you